Yes, guys. Now here on the opposite side of the road by the church, we're looking, not to, looking down to Holy Innocence. Um, Holy Innocence Primary School here with the mural graphic on it. Holy Innocence Primary School with the mural graphic on it. And this was the girls' school. And the mural graphic is a new addition to Holy Innocence Primary School. Well, this was a bottom building before. It was a board and shingle building. And this is the church here. And this is the church cemetery wall. So again, this church carries two cemeteries, one in the churchyard and one on the opposite side of the road. Again, this is your road to Harrison's Cave on Rich Mahogany. And Harrison's Cave runs all underground here. Like I said, the main service is going on at the church. That the organ from the church vibrates into the cave. That's where the gas station up here in Rich Mahogany had to be closed of some years back because the pumps were going into the cave. That's kind of looking back at Holy Innocent School. No, again with the mural graphic. I'm uh, looking down to Ashford Wrong Road. And this is Holy Innocence Anglican Church. As I said before, Holy Innocence was built in 1838 and dedicated in 1839. It was built on lands given by the owners of Ashford Plantation and it was built in the shape of a cross and it was one of the Bishop Coleridge Chapels of East. And this is the church cemetery here. So this is Ashford, St. Thomas, Ashford spelled A-Y-S-H-F-O-R-D and this is the route to Harrison's Cave or Rich Mahogany. And straight up Above the church here will be Sally Corner, where Welsh Mahal begins, and that will be the post office. The post office is right at the top here, St. Thomas Post Office. And again, I look at Holy Innocence, kind of the kind of church. <clears throat> and I look back down to Ashford again. So again, Holy Innocence School is where my family, on my mother's side, my aunts, cousins, and great grandparents receive their primary education. And some of them, I, have, I also have family buried in this church yeah, as well, such as my great aunts, and great uncles, and great grandparents, and one of my aunts and cousins are buried in this churchyard. Yeah. Well, not really over here, but over here. Yes, this is Holy Innocence. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Holy Innocence Anglican Church and School. And this is the entrance to the church. Looking back at the Sally Corner. And this is 
is where the boys school used to be and this is the road through here that we take back to Bayern's Road which is known to many residents as the line and this is the fucking pavilion here the church cemetery so again I'm in the heart of Barbados St. Thomas and St. George are the two parishes in the center of the island, best referred to as the heart of Barbados or the central uplands of Barbados. So there is no sea nor coastline in these parishes. Innocence Primary School building. And the church. So this church will cater to the spiritual needs of persons living in Richmond Hall, Hortwell, Bridgefield, Sturges, Lancastle, Highland, and Chapman's Village. Or in the parish of St. Thomas. As I said before, this was one of the Bishop Coleridge chapels of East, and it was built in 1838 and dedicated in 1839. You can see the church vicarage here, where the priest used to live. I don't think that this current priest lives there. And this is all this church yard here, the church cemetery. So thank you guys for watching now. And have a blessed evening.